Hello everyone, I'm Endymion for the Dork at Arms, etc. And... Guys, it's a bark! Hold on, I'm gonna change the lighting real quick. Boy, this room is gonna get sweltering hot in about five minutes, but I don't care! I've just read a fantastic book. I read it, I finished it a couple days ago. It's very good. Holy fuck. The main character is <laughs> such an asshole. It's so funny. Um, but also, like, for medievalists, uh, medieval enthusiasts, and sci-fi enthusiasts, fantasy enthusiasts, this is good. This, this book is good. It's based on, like, sieges. Uh, it's also based on, like, Roman Imperial stuff and, like, Holy, um, Holy Roman Empire stuff. But it's so good. It's this asshole has to defend a walled city that he doesn't like and just try to do shit. He's not hes not a soldier or a tactician. He's just an engineer. Uh, but at the same time, it's like there's a lot of politics and it's so much fun. It's like... It's not laugh out loud funny, but it is amusing. And it's not like a tearjerker, but it is still moving and kind of thought-provoking, particularly the end, because this is framed as a memoir, like uh, a, a history of the Great Siege, and it's like, this is fun. This is fun. 16 Ways to Defend a Walled City. Uh, I'm going to try to find, uh, try to buy the other two books in the Siege trilogy that K.J. Parker, I know that's a pseudonym, but K.J. Parker is still a good name. Mm! Uh, the other two books that he wrote in this setting. I can't wait uh, to read those because this one is so good and so fun and it feeds my medievalist soul. It's so good. I love it. Y'all should read it. Uh, I'll put a link to Barnes & Noble. This video isn't sponsored, but, you know, fuck it. Anyway, I'm a demon for the Rocket Arms, etc. And please subscribe if you want more. Like if you like this video and leave a suggestion in the comments or any critiques. Bye!